Hey everyone, it's me, the new Starman, and I would like to, well, I would honestly like to show you guys a couple of the new items coming in the 1.8 update. Now, currently, I'm going on the 1.8 beta, and right now, I'm in the middle of a jungle, as you all can plainly see. And, I have a crossbow. <laughs> that never gets old. I came here to show a lot of the new updates, but I can't find any. I mean, I can use the scaffolding. Shit. Ah. Okay. If I can find one. It, oh, 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 there it is. There it is. Pit under it. Look. It's, it's a panda. Yeah. Look at this. It's a giant panda. And um, add its ass. Okay. It's a, whoa. What? What are you doing? Sneezy. <laughs> Okay, okay, little guy. Let's get let's get you out of here. Whoa! Wait! Wait! What's up, little guy? Hmm. And then, if I'm right, there should be some bamboo nearby. I mean, where there are pandas, there are bamboo. Hmm. Uh, right. Anyway, I may as well show you guys some of the new updates that are also coming in. Yes, yeah, so why not? Meaning, I'm going to have to go into this. So I can just turn on the always day. Oh, wait, no. There we go. Let's see. Uh, hmm. Okay, so let's take a look at what else we got. Like I showed you guys, we have a crossbow. But that's not all we got for the crossbow. It could shoot, um, well, both arrows and well, fireworks. Speaking of which. I had to unload that. Let's see here. Okay. As with every update, any sort of newer update... Or rather, any sort of newer, well, enchantments are going to be all the way down here. So you've got piercing and quick charge. And multi-shot. Let's see, from what I can guess, this, um, this increases the damage. This decreases the loading time. And this increases the amount of shots fired. Alright, let's take a look here. Ooh, melon. Okay, okay, okay. That could be a good spot. But you know what I would honestly be happy to see if uh, if possible with one of these things? I would honestly love, 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 love to see it shoot flaming arrows. That would be awesome. Wait. Could it? If this could shoot this, I'll be so happy. Confirmed. It shoots tipped arrows. Woo! <laughs> okay, that's awesome. But, okay. Now we get back to the real thing here. Und, I have an idea of what to call it, given the fact that it is Halloween month. I mean, that it is the month of Halloween. Oh, wait, what? Huh. Okay, I believe I just fucked something over. No, no, no. There we go. Multi-shot. As you guys can see, it increases the amount of spread while also adding in, well, a spread. 
allows you to shoot three, count them, three different sort of tipped arrows. So let's take a look at the other one. If I remember correct, Sorry if this seems a little impromptu and I don't have anything set up. Might as well have done it a little differently, you know? Wait, so if the person doesn't work for this, let's see, I'm going to do that. OT, Tom, Shell Piercing. Oh, they should all be on this guy, right? Unless it's something new. We got this thing. I can't imagine someone flying around with the elite truck. Just going about as high as we can with this thing in hand. Finding some sort of a target to fly up to. And. Oh. Wait, yeah, that's right. Man, that's handy. Going up to say maybe the highest area. Say maybe, I don't know, this tree? And flying about, or rather gliding about, looking for some new The thing is, these things take a while to shoot! Damn it, almost had it. Oh, shit! Well, you guys know what I mean. At least I can eat tonight. <laughs> okay, okay. Anyway, uh, you guys, if you were wondering, um, I haven't been able to make any sort of recent videos lately because of the hurricane. My house wasn't necessarily hit by it. And... That was not a shot. Anyway, I wasn't necessarily hit by it, but my house was affected by it, and so was my town. We didn't have power for like a couple of days. Like, two days at most, and well, I wasn't at the house to record anything and didn't have anything to record for. But, you know, whatever. I can record now, and I'm sorry for putting this off for, like, so long. I mean, I promised it on Twitter. I haven't recorded anything for over a fortnight, and now I'm doing it. Okay, so, if I remember correctly, we also have a new mob group called the Pillagers. They're a new form of illager that are meant to, well, pillage. And, if I can kind of guess correctly... Oh, wait. That's for a sea turtle? Huh. Weird. Anyway, once we find the egg so that we can get around... Wait, where is it? Evoker, shulker... Da, 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 da. Phantoms, I'm a villager. Hmm. It should be around here somewhere. Huh, well that's weird, I can't seem to find it. That is, unless they don't have a spawn egg, which kind of makes sense. Hmm. Well, well. But, we do have something new called bamboo, which you need to create the scaffolding. And, you know what? I'm just going to show you guys how to craft a lot of this stuff. Hey, Bigfoot. Uh. Hey, fella. You what? Oh, my God. That is so cute. I didn't know they did that. That's so adorable. Here, here, here. You want some more? Oh, God. I'm going to be a screenshot of that. There we go. Oh, man, that's cute. That is so adorable. Anyway, over into this ravine. We can go over here and plot down some stuff. I'm going to show you how to do a little bit of the crafting by first pulling in one of these. And, huh, that's 
see here. Oh, wait. Yeah, I should probably switch over to survival for this one. Because then we'll be able to tell what we need. Behold, for scaffolding, you need three bamboo up, three bamboo down on both sides. And a piece of string. Seems pretty straightforward enough. Well, this was fun. Shoot. I don't know, I got scaffolding right here. I can just build my way up. Uh, remember, to use the scaffolding here, you need to hold up the jump button in order to climb up rather quickly. This ought to be great for uh, builders like me. Uh, the thing is, you need a foundation to support different scaffolding. Like, say, uh, let's see how far this one can go. Well, four on ain't that bad. The thing is, like the uh, building, like the constructs in Fortnite, it needs a steady base. Otherwise, <laughs> oh man, that's actually going to come in real handy. Really implement that in the Star Wars. Anyway, down through here. Like I'm making a way through and find some lava. Uh, man, this is actually not going as well as we're pleased. Hang on for a second. Anyway, coming over to here. There's just more that You see here we have. Ah, oh my god, that's so cute. Ooh. I'll take you with me and I'll name you Church. Thank you. There's gotta be some fish around here, right? Good salmon. Hey, where did the little cat go? What, do I need raw fish? Oh shit, then where's the raw food? Where's the raw food? Uh oh. Right, so, uh, this is a little bad. Though I know what I could use. A bucket of... Oh, fuck. Oh, here we are. See you, man. Top of the bush. Come in again. Here we'll see... Oh. Hello, little guy. Oh, my God. That is so cute and uh, a little weird. Um... No offense, but how does this work? That's its sitting pose? Are you kidding me? Anyway, I'll name you Church. Come on, Church. Oh, look at that. He follows me. That's so cute. Anyway, um... Yeah, no problem, little fella. Anyway, once I get this bow out, I'll show you how to crack it properly. And you know what? I'm probably going to need a crossbow anyway. Probably upgraded a bit. Oh, wait, where's the crossbow? Oh, hell. I forgot to turn on the... I'll be right back. Anyway, now that I'm back, I have to change some things up. Okay, let's bring out the crafting table. You want to know how you can craft one of these babies? Well, then let's get into survival and I'll show you. Watch and learn. Okay, so the crafting for the crossbow is not exactly implemented, and apparently, neither is the use of fireworks rockets. I also got heard that you can utilize firework rockets to apparently, uh, well, launch them. Actually, be pretty freaking sweet if I could just take a crossbow into some punk face and then do something like that. That would be freaking sweet. But if I understand correctly, there should be another mob coming soon. I don't 
Let's see. Uh, ah. ch -ch -ch -ch. Hmm. ah, there we go. Let's see. Uh, slow falling. Oh, wait, that's another potion, isn't it? Ooh, that sounds actually pretty cool. Let's see. Uh, okay, here we are. Potion of slow falling, which I will show in a minute on how to make. Thing is, how does this work? This is ridiculous. Can I just do some This would be so easy to build with. Let's try it. Jump real style. Yeah! Okay, that's funny. <laughs> Block that. Anyway, you guys get the idea. It stops you from falling fast or taking any sort of fall damage. Good for a quick escape. In fact, let's see how little damage it actually causes. I mean, how much damage it subtracts. Life's been too cruel to me. Oh, it doesn't cause any fall damage at all. That's handy. Makes me feel like I'm on the moon. One small step for man. One giant leap for mankind. Uh, Houston, we have gotten you over. <laughs> oh, God. I'm pretty sure this was using a couple of mods, actually. And now it's fully implemented. Oh, uh, this is awesome. <laughs> hey. Hey. What are you weird looking at? Got your number. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is get out a possible test subject. Iron. Now I get to all the classical. Well. going to do here is build the best test subject for well, mods and whatnot. You all know him as Frank. <laughs> no, 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 but, but seriously. What I'm going to do is utilize a tipped arrow with this special potion on. Behold my metallic friend who's apparently stuck in another metallic friend. Or is this a weird glitch? It is a weird glitch. Hey, dude. Dude, 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 dude. Stop freaking out. Come on, dude. Okay. There we go. It lasts for 30 seconds, meaning that should last just long enough. Ooh, and that pullback animation, too. Yes, we need. Uh, boy. Okay, I know of only one. I can only think of one way of how to get rid of this glitch problem. <laughs> this is going to take a, a really long time. Oh. Uh, uh, I didn't uh, 
off film, but I uh, leave film off. So anyway, let's uh, fill this a little bit of me, shall we? Now that what I am doing right now should not be something I'm about to knock down a uh, husk. This could potentially kill everyone, meaning that I should also have a sword on hand. Just be safe. Unless you have good precautions. Okay, so that worked. Hmm. But would it work? But you know what? I honestly want to test one more. Uh, let's see. I'll select cat, mushroom, a mushroom, bad parrot. Oh, Enderman. Enderman. Ah. I don't know. Vindicator, Evoker, Vex. Villager. There we go. Oh. Oh, fuck. Okay. Why do I keep forgetting that? Okay. And okay. Coming down. Going safe. It's good. Nice. It worked out just fine. <laughs> all right, that's all I got to show you today. Um, if some pillagers may show up because this is the village and pillage mod. Then, um, you know, I could, uh, bring it back up when it happens. But right, thank you all for watching. Be, if you guys like this video, be sure to hit the like button down below. Also, this is the first video that you've seen by me. Be sure to hit the subscribe button to watch more videos whenever I put them out. And be sure to ring that little bell in order to become part of the notification squad. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye!